Hey everybody, this is Randy Santel and welcome to episode number seven of Dinner is Served. For episode number six, we went with Mexican food for Cinco de Mayo. This morning I woke up hungry for some burgers, so we decided let's eat burgers. One of the top rated burger restaurants here in Springfield, Missouri is Black Sheep. And there's four locations all around Springfield. We went to the Black Sheep ASAP location, which is still open for takeout, and they've got delivery services too. I went with all 11 of the burgers and chicken sandwiches on their menu. Let's explain those now. For item number one, I got the single patty ugly cheeseburger. There's a four ounce steak patty topped with sharp white cheddar, butter lettuce, pickles, onions, and then their bad sauce. Item number two is their Born in the USA burger with a four ounce steak patty topped with American cheese, minced onions, and then their mustard mayonnaise. Item number three is their Don't Go Bake in My Heart burger. There's a four ounce steak patty topped with delicious applewood smoked bacon, black diamond extra sharp cheddar cheese, butter lettuce, pickles, onions, and then their smoky garlic mayo. Item number four is their foodie burger. There's a four ounce steak patty topped with herb garlic cheese, caramelized onions, and then their truffle mayonnaise. Item number five is their Jamaican Me Crazy burger. There's a four ounce steak patty topped with ghost pepper jack cheese, jerk seasoning, butter lettuce, pickles, onions, and then their pineapple jam mayonnaise. Item number six is their Blues Brothers burger. There's a four ounce steak patty topped with blue cheese, avocado, candied bacon, butter lettuce, pickles, onions, and then their truffle mayonnaise. Item number seven is their massive Cowboy Carl burger. There's a four ounce steak patty topped with a whole bunch of smoked brisket, candied bacon, sharp white cheddar cheese, spiky fried onions, pickles, and then their barbecue sauce. Item number eight is their Spring Philly burger. There's a four ounce steak patty topped with four ounces of marinated filet, grilled red pepper and onion, and then their organic baba cheese sauce. Item number nine is their Lost My Mind deep fried chicken sandwich. It's got a deep fried chicken breast topped with butter lettuce, pickles, onions, healthy tomatoes, and then their ranch mayonnaise. Item number 10 is their Dorkney grilled chicken sandwich. It's got a grilled chicken breast topped with butter lettuce, pickles, onions, tomatoes, and then their ranch mayonnaise. Last but not least, I went with their veggie burger for item number 11. It's got cauliflower that's been breaded and fried, topped with butter lettuce, tomatoes, onions, pickles, and then their ranch mayonnaise. Alright, I had a great three hour ride last night, so I am starving, ready to eat some burgers. Big thank you to everybody with Black Sheep for the delicious meal in front of me. Thanks for serving up dinner for this episode number seven. Along with all the burgers and sandwiches that I got, I got an order of their truffle fries, which I've had them before. Very, very excited because they're delicious. And then I've never had this before. They sold it to me when I was picking everything up, but I love cookie dough. And this cookie dough they've got has chocolate chips, peanut butter and marshmallows. So who can say no to that, especially only 99 cents. But this entire meal was just over $102. So big thank you to everybody helping us through our Patreon page and then helping through giving stars on Facebook. You're all sponsoring this Dinner is Served series. So thank you. Great to support the team at Black Sheep. But for now, let's shut up and eat. One, two, three, boom. All right, I had a terrible strategy on that Mexican food. I saved the biggest thing for last. So I'm gonna do the big burgers first, starting with this cowboy car. More fried healthy vegetables in these onion straws. Time for their spring Philly burger. We got started a lot faster today, so thankfully all these are still pretty hot. I don't remember the name of this one, but it's got candied bacon on it, so this is gonna be a fun one. This has the blue cheese. Oh. This burger would be so good if you like blue cheese. 
If you like blue cheese, that makes only one of us. <laughs> I don't know what this is either, because it's got two patties, and I only ordered one patty ones, but it does look good. All right, we are 10 minutes in. We've eaten five items now. We've got six left. I think I took down the five biggest things. This fried chicken sandwich is still a big one, but I think it's all downhill from here along with these fries. We'll eat those soon too, but mm, delicious so far. This one's loaded with caramelized onions. Ooh, making some cold, ice cold water. I think that's gonna help get the rest down, but ooh, one last burger left, burger number eight. All these are the, the veggie burger and the two chicken sandwiches. Seems to have some kick to it. I don't know if this one's the one with the ghost pepper cheese or what. Ooh, I want to get all these down before I worry about fries. I was going to eat some along the way, but let's get this veggie burger down with all this fried cauliflower. Should go down pretty good with all these healthy vegetables in addition to the fried cauliflower. It's a good thing for people ordering it's got two chicken breasts on it but oh for me i just want to finish one minutes and 52 seconds in this one's got two chicken breasts on it too I'm gonna have one of these fried chicken breasts and then eat the rest as part of the sandwich almost done Oh, last burger and sandwich, under 38 minutes. Time for some truffle fries. I've been to Black Sheep probably three or four times and I've always had the truffle fries, so I didn't want to get them on this because I had so much other food, but I wanted to show them off because if you go to Black Sheep, you gotta try them, they're delicious. Oh, one thing 
for sure. You can't say I'm taking it easy on these. Ugh, I want to go back to doing food challenges just because those are easier. Now we are on to this. This is safe to eat cookie dough, salmonella free. <laughs> Color me excited. What? Good. It definitely has marshmallows in it. Does that mean it's low in calories? Yeah. Low sodium marshmallows, I think, are in this. I can't really taste the peanut butter yet. Maybe I was wrong that there's, maybe there's not peanut butter in here. But definitely chocolate chips and marshmallows. Leave no doubt. Ah! Oh, this is not the first time I'm saying this, but that was a lot more food than I thought I was ordering. But got it down, took a long time, but I am definitely getting myself ready for 2020 with all these home food challenges. Big thank you to everybody with Black Sheep here in Springfield, Missouri. There's four locations, great to support them. I know they and their parent company, they do a lot for the Springfield community, which is much appreciated. Definitely gotta say my favorites were the first two things I started out with, that Cowboy Carl, and then the Spring Philly was delicious too. If you live in the Springfield area and you haven't already, be sure to check out one of the four Black Sheep locations. And if you don't, hopefully this video inspired you and made you hungry to the point where you wanna go out and support a similar small business near you. Thanks for watching.